So I went to Riffing Reality today and I got him a pair. Riffer gang, Riffer gang, Riffer gang. Well, I'm not a singer, so forgive my singing, bad singing. Hey guys, how are y'all doing? And I really hope y'all are doing well. You know what? Uh, uh, one, two weeks ago, I posted this video on I'm adding something dangerous to my tank. And in fact, I added two clown where there was already a pair inside the tank, right? Although these two new uh, peculiar snowflakes were okay, they were doing well. They are harmless, but when I added in, um, for the first few days, I even posted how they were in the first few days. It was already okay, right? Then one of them, uh, it got a little aggressive. It wasn't really aggressive, but it was a little aggressive. It was like, you know, always darting towards one another. So I caught by accident. You know, when I was there, he's actually really looking okay. But then when I saw from far, I saw him doing that. I was still okay with that. I mean, eventually I'm going to transfer them to my big tank. So I think for clownfish in a big five feet should be okay. You know, in 180 gallons should be okay. You know, so but then I got problems because my tank is not ready. Uh, in order to do my sum, redo everything, it's going to take another three more weeks. Then I was thinking, oh my goodness, I didn't know that this was coming. So that means they have to wait at least a month before I transfer them out. And all four in one tank. Oh no, how can they cope? Were they able to survive? And you know the day I posted the video? You know what happened? The night, I didn't really see my tank. Usually I was glance my tank because my tank is in my room. That's why I moved to my big tank. I want to put it outside so I can really enjoy it. You know, usually I'm not in my room. So I feel a bit like sad that, hey, I'm not really enjoying my tank in the room. Right? That's the purpose. So I didn't really look at it because it was in the room until next morning. I realized, eh, one clownfish seems missing. So I, I look around, look around, look around, and then I realized it's my favorite mocha storm clownfish, which is known as shark bait. He's missing. And he was okay, you know? The next thing I saw, he was on the ground, died. He probably jumped out in the night. I don't know how. Was he attacked? Or what he was actually the bigger one you know i don't know why but he was out my the the clownfish pair uh which was the other one which was tiger king he was so so sad that this happened to him right and and so this was a chaos to me because i felt sad for another two three days that shark bait died shark bait died Yes, my dear friends. Sorry for shouting. Huh? It's just that I was really, really emotional. You know, sometimes when a fish is very dear to you, uh, imagine even other pets like dogs and cats, you know, how painful. But even fishes, uh, when you love them, it's very hard when they die. Yeah, uh, Tiger King was also very sad. Eventually, I took out the, the slightly aggressive one and I left the other one to maybe pair up, you know. Um, but seems like they didn't really pair up, so I gave them away, you know. Now, Tiger King is all alone and I feel sad for him. So, I decided let's pair him up again. Someone who looks exactly like Shark Bit. So, I went to Reaping Reality today. And I got him a pair 
right and if you can see I got him a pair my dad will name him uh, shark bait again I might not because uh, every character is different uh, shark bait was still very special so I will probably give him another name if you have one to suggest please do so right so with that I want to just tell you that my my game was played very badly for two of it I thought it could work out fine with four clown fish my dear friends don't do it just keep it to two especially if they are pair you do not want to confuse the pair unless you really have a huge huge tank but you know if they are pair just keep it as a pair that was really my mistake right uh, if I have given you wrong advice I'm appall I, I'm really sorry I apologize right i really hope and really really hope that these two will pair up and that's it i probably would not get any more clownfish and hopefully they transit to the tank right the good thing about this one um even though it's more pricier than what i had it's grade a uh and also he's really pellet feeding he's really eating a lot of my pellets just now in the shop i am really happy i got something so with that just be careful my dear friends okay right Remember, fish are friends, not fruit. And see you in the next video. Peace. Okay, who wants to put it for me? First time, first time. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. When the road looks rough ahead in your mouth. Miles from your nice warm bed. You just remember what your old pal said. For you've got a friend in me. Yeah, you've got a friend in me. You've got a friend in me. You've got a friend in me. You've got troubles, well, I've got them too There isn't anything I wouldn't do for you We stick together and see it through Cause you've got a friend in me Yeah, you've got a friend in me you got a friend in me Yeah, you got a friend in me